Makeup artist and blogger Ileana Treese, welcome to the show. Thank you for having and me. And this is a challenge for a lot of folks. Mm -hmm. You look great when you're ready to go, but then you walk out the door and, and suddenly it all. And that Houston humid heat just like melts your face. Exactly. All right, I got the tip. So this is from Scandinavia. You know how like when we leave, we need to spray our hair, right? So it can right? stay in place. This is your hairspray for your makeup. It's less than twenty dollars. You can find it on Amazon. And when you're done with the look, here I will show you. You want to spray it, maybe not all up on the on the face, but just a little bit back. So about 12 inches away. Yeah, there. just a little spritz. It actually feels super refreshing. Doesn't it feel nice? It's, it's <laughs> and it nice just and sets cooling, everything, right? Yes. And this is setting what you've already worked on. So even it's going to withstand the humidity as well. Yes, and it's going to make it, your makeup look more like skin versus like powder. Oh, I keep okay. it in the fridge, so does, it feels really nice. Does it make a difference though, what kind of makeup someone has on their face, or does that work with anything? Everything, powders, creams. It's going to bulletproof everything. And that's wow. about twenty-six dollars yeah. on Amazon, right? Yeah. Okay, that's Easy a good investment. Find. Okay, so the next thing that we're looking at here, the trend for summer is sort of a bright eye. Does that mean shadow and liner, or what? What does that mean? It, in this case, yes. So like right now, New York Fashion Week, we saw a lot of like bold, bright neon colors. Actually, we see that in the clothing as well, right? So why not add it into your makeup routine? So this is NYX. It's a 10, it's a 10 shadow palette. For only $20, you get 10 bold, brilliant colors to play with for the summer. So this is a really good one. And that's a beautiful look, uh, Camilla Bea, that we just saw. Very, yes. very nice. That's that basically I think, our yeah, inspiration. Yeah, she, she was uh, rocking the green color. Nice. Yeah, it can be any color. Like, there's so many great options in here. I just love personally playing with orange and blue. I feel like they contrast beautifully together. Now, how do you avoid making someone look like a clown, though? Because I can imagine with a color palette that bright, I am so glad wrong. you asked that. I feel like you really need to know how to blend. So if you look at this brush, it's very close and compact. So it's going to apply a lot of color. So that's why I'm using it on the lid. But to answer your question, you're going to want to go back in with something fluffy to get that nice blend out so it doesn't really have an edge. It just looks really nice. And, and you're seamless. blending with the same color? Yeah, the okay. same color. You don't have to have a transition color. You just have to change the brush. So that's more of like a ponytail fluffy brush. Yes. Okay. That, that's going to give you that nice like blurred out effect on the end. And um, if you can show up that that palette again because again these colors are very bold. Um, and which one are you using on her? I am using this. It's like, it matches okay. my nails. Yeah. It's like a beautiful coral, like ready for summer. And okay. then we're going to use this blue. When you use eyeliner, like a bold eyeliner, you don't have to use a liquid eyeliner. You can absolutely use an eyeshadow. Okay. So we're using a pencil brush. Look up for me. And we're just going to run it along her lash line. Beautiful. Easy to, it is beautiful. And I love that you've paired it with some soft curls on Melanie's head. Very, very yes. nice look. we got to move on to our next look. Great and job. Uh, great job, Melanie. Monica is our next model. Describe her look and how you created it. This is my favorite. So it's summer. We all want the J-Lo glow, right? So Absolutely. you can tell she's very like bronze. We are actually um, on the runway this year. It's all about bronzer, but actually in place of the blush. Usually bronzer is like underneath the cheekbone to highlight the, the uh, cheek. But we're going to use this um, as a blush instead. So Bronzer is also one of those things you got to go really easy on, though, right? Yes. Yeah, so I like to use something that's fluffy so you can um, really build it up. So it doesn't put too much, because then you're like, oh, you're in trouble, right? If you're so. applying bronzer in three seconds, that's not enough time. You need to really take your time yeah. with it, right? And I think also you have to be careful of how shimmery it is, because you really Absolutely. want the bronze color, not you the want, shimmer. You want a matte color when it comes to bronzer, because anything matte is going to like descend, and anything you put a highlight is going to come full. So when you're contouring and bronzing, you want a matte color. You also recommend uh, some techniques for the lip and for the hairstyle when paired with a bronzer. Yes, yeah, so I love to show off her skin. So we put it, um, Jan Villano did our hair. So we did it in a nice sleek J-Lo bun um, just to kind of show off like the her bronzy skin. But this is like from Scott Barnes himself, J-Lo's makeup artist. It's new to Gina Spray. It's actually a sunscreen. And this is what he uses on J-Lo. And if it's good enough for J-Lo, it's good for us, right? So it gives, you, it gives you that nice gloss Can I and, have the it's, extra? <laughs> and it's a SPF. So you're protecting your skin and looking fabulous. Oh Monica, you my look gosh. Great. <laughs> okay, let's bring out our last model, Jennifer, because we want to make sure we see her look. Very summery, fun look. And you, what you did here. Yeah, this is the, the makeup. This no is makeup. the no makeup makeup look. So it's very subtle, it's very soft and natural. It looks like she's like shining from within. Look down. What do they say? I woke up like this, right? Yes. <laughs> Just a little bit of color. So, so you're using one thing all over the face. Yes, it's a cream. So the good thing about a cream is that you can use it on your lips, eyes, and cheek. 
This is, uh, it's under $30 and you just tap it onto the areas where you want it. And this is called nude sticks, three in one? Yes, yeah, so they're great for traveling or if you're going to the beach and you wanna add like a little bit of color or really, close your mouth, um, if you're like on the go and you don't have time to put like a full face, just right. real quick, eat quick and easy, get some color going. You can use it on the lip as Fantastic. well. And I noticed you paired the hair with uh, some beach waves. Yes, Soften it's very up. nice, very effortless, nice like going to the beach look, very subtle as well. All right, Ileana, happy summer. Thanks to all of our models as well. By the way, if you would like to connect with Ileana, you can visit the Scene on Houston Life section of our website. Thanks so much, ladies. Thank you.